Sierra LLC Home Instruction Series presents Air Cycler. Hi guys, I'm Kyle with Sierra LLC and today I'm here to talk to you about the air cycler that's installed in your home. Uh, the air cycler is a device that sometimes gives a little bit of confusion to you as a homeowner um, and mostly the way that you would notice that is uh, take a look at your thermostat and you see that it's set to off and the fan switch is set to auto uh, and that would lead you to believe that you should never have any air coming out of the vents. Well, the air cycler is a device that's installed on your equipment and it's up in the attic. Um, and it's completely independent control from your thermostat. So even when your thermostat's off, that air cycler can still turn the fan on and, and uh, distribute air through your home. Uh, the reason the air cycler is installed primarily is because your home builder has built a very well insulated, very tight home. And what that means is that you get very little air infiltration from outside air coming into the house. And in order to have a good level of indoor air quality, we need to provide air changes, bring outside air into the home and uh, dilute any pollutants that could be in the home. And that could simply be carbon dioxide from you being in the house breathing or uh, VOCs, which are volatile organic compounds that come from things like paint and, and fresh carpet smell. All those smells you smell with uh, that type of stuff are VOCs. And uh, bringing fresh air into the home is gonna help remove that and keep the indoor air quality at a good level for you. So what's actually happening when the air cycler turns on, it's also opening a damper uh, that's on a fresh air duct that goes outside. So when the fan turns on, it's actually drawing outside air into the home, a very small amount. Typically it's a four to six inch duct. So it's not enough air to uh, really affect the temperature inside your home. Uh, it's just bringing just enough fresh air in to keep the indoor air quality at an acceptable level. And that is designed to be there. It's not designed to be removed. The mechanical engineer that designed the system on your home uh, has specified that to be there. It's required. Uh, there's actually a mechanical code, code called ASHRAE 62.2 that requires um, a form of mechanical ventilation. And that's the reason that the air cycler is installed on your home. Now, we have the ability and we do set the air cyclers so that they run from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. So it's only allowed to turn the fan on and bring fresh air in the home during the day so that when you're sleeping at night, you don't get any objectionable air noise or feel any drafts from the air blowing out of the vents or anything like that. So that's a feature that, that we take advantage of to help it be less, less invasive to you. Um, and that's a, a brief rundown of the air cycler and why you need it and why it's important that it's installed in your home and why it shouldn't be tampered with. So hopefully that helps clear some things up on what the air cycler is for and uh, thank you for watching today.